And we're back. All right. After a second disconnection of this fucking show. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we already said I it. could give Fuck two it. fucks if it's explicit at this point. We have disconnected twice, and if you're still listening in, then God bless you for tuning in. You know what I'm going I'm, I'm to attribute it to is the fact that I had to pull up all of my stories and Miggy's story at once, so I had about 17 websites going at one time. Oh. There you go. So let's get out of the K-State story. Let's get into this story. I teased this before the break. There is a woman that is pressing charges after finding out that her online boyfriend of two years... Turned out to be a woman. What? Oh, online boyfriend. Now it online. makes sense. Online. For two years they were together. A woman told police of her disbelief when she discovered that her boyfriend of two years was a female friend. The complainant said she thought she was having sex with a man called Kai Fortune, who Kai claimed he was recovering from a brain tumor and did not want her to see his scars. Apparently, this 25-year-old woman, Gail Newland, was persuaded to wear a blindfold during their sexual encounters in which a prosthetic was used. Right. Yes, yes, yes. Gail so Newland of Williston, that, Cheshire, not. is on trial at Chester Crown Court, where she I denies that's five Chester counts. Shyster. She <laughs> denies five counts. Good point. <laughs> denies five counts of sexual assault between February and June 2013. Apparently, Kai Fortune purported to be half Filipino, half Latino. Uh, they communicated online. Kater, K- Kai later told her he had a brain tumor. Apparently, every time they hooked up, he used a fake schwanz. And she said his voice was high-pitched. When you say he, you mean she. Exactly. We find out that Kai is actually an existing good friend of Gail's. But they knew each other oh, prior. Oh, yes. It's a lesbo fantasy. Yes. I think, I think Gail knew. And let me ask you a question, because you're the closest thing to a female we have. Couldn't you tell the difference between a, a dildo and a real penis, Ben? Um, think about your butt plug. Well, it depends where it enters. If, if I'm looking, then I can tell a difference, obviously. I will say this. Can I, you tell a difference between your butt plug and Andy? Um, yes, yes. The butt plug is much larger. Um, but I will say this. I will say this. What kind of a shitty girlfriend is Gail? Seriously. Okay, uh, you guys want to... Wait, Sam did she Gale. go there or... You guys want to say I'm Gail you want, and that's fine. But seriously, let's, let's, let's get serious about this. Okay, let's see. What, what kind of a shitty girlfriend... Oh, I know where you're What going. kind of a shitty girlfriend is Gail? Because, really, dude had a fake penis, and she never noticed. So, you know what this tells me, guys? What? She it wasn't never, in her she mouth She never enough? gave a blowjob. <laughs> oh, that's but then a very again, good point. But then again, blindfold, how was she supposed to uh, find it prosthetic, once it was pulled out? Prosthetic penis, though. Seriously, she didn't know that it was fake? Well, Ben, you know. She's a shitty girlfriend. Yeah, ben, I agree y- with you. you. Or has never had a penis in her mouth before. Or, or, like the rest of us guys here, have never had a penis or a fake penis in our mouth before, so we wouldn't know the difference. So can we can we get can we get like back? Ben might? Well, you're missing out. Can we get Caleb? back? You're can missing we, out. Can we get back to the point that this is a lady who may or may not be extremely ugly and overweight. This is a lady who has oh, yeah. never met this person and will agree to have sex with them with a blindfold on without ever seeing them ever at all. Stacy, that's a very valid point. Stacy, kind of fortune. The no, Kai Fortune the was in an accident. He had a brain tumor. He didn't want her to see his scars. Right. So she's Have you no heart. The person. Have you no heart. But she says, get in here. Is there a picture of her? Because if she's hot, I want I, I, I want to know her on I want to know her online name. I have a picture yeah. of the boyfriend. Are you ready to see the boyfriend? The boyfriend. This here, is the here's the boyfriend. Oh my goodness. That's, That's supposed to be a dude? It looks well, like a dude. With kinda a looks like, it does kind of look like Harry, Harry, what's his name? The Potter guy. With a blindfold, yeah. it is. <laughs> Daniel Radcliffe. Yeah, it looks a little bit him like Him and his delicious <laughs> asshole? Yes. <laughs> with, it with looks a lot like him and his delicious asshole. That's what you're referring to. Uh, uh, Lord Cheese, you might want to preface that statement with the, uh, the, <laughs> the fact that <laughs> he's gay. Game. Yes, yes. Oh, I apologize. <laughs> I don't think our listeners know about the, as much <laughs> the, the card in, uh, in the oh, name. Oh, Cards the, Against g- Humanity. Yeah. You just, uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yes. Daniel Radcliffe's asshole may or may not be delicious. That is not my point. That is a game card. Oh, yes. I think you made a point there. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> I think you made a very explicit point <laughs> that I'm not the only one. Stop deflecting how gay you are. Oh, just me? Really? Daniel Radcliffe? Really? Well, come on. He would turn a guy's head. 
Yeah. He's well, a magician for Christ. Well, wizard. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I know you're. I know you're a big fan of Quidditch. I mean, Quidditch. I I am actually. I yeah. am. That's a big sport. As in a dick for a quid. Yeah. And if for some reason you can't get it up, you don't need Viagra. He just goes Wingardium Leviosa. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Wow, you even know the Did you just bust out with <laughs> geeky <laughs> wizard slang? I gotta be honest. Oh, God. You know how I know Stace is gay? He just busted the out. Gra- the Great Britain <laughs> Harry education Potter. system definitely is way above us because right. I never learned any of that here Guys, in the States. Yeah. That's awesome. Well, just, it, you may need that one night when the whiskey is taken its toll. You may need Guys, it. Guys, I think the alcohol has taken its toll. I think we're at the end of this show. It's what? I do want to no, I, no, no, I no. want to talk about this last uh, last story we have here. What, the white people are weird? No, the oh, weatherman. The weatherman. The weatherman. Not only because we have Lord Cheese here. The weatherman nails oh, the I sent this. I sent this name into you guys. Only you a did few weeks ago. You did. Do you know how to say it? Can you say it? Uh, no, but I know. It, I know it ends go 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 go. Yeah, and it starts well, clan. He actually says this name, and you know I haven't counted it out, but it's uh, I don't know, probably thirty characters long. Oh, hold, hold on, hold on, hold on, just a second. hold on, hold on, Stacey, Stacey, 58. Stacey how yes. does it end again? Go go go. Do it again. Go go go. You d- why are you gagging? Because <laughs> <laughs> this microphone's big. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Hey, well, let's hear what the weatherman has to it's say It's got here. a mushroom hat. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm going to play the audio. Oh, boy. Please do. Now, today we had a big contrast in temperature across the UK, just 12 degrees over coastal parts of eastern England with cloudy skies. But in the sunshine in northwest Wales at RAF Mona, just up the road from Clan Byrd, Pushwing, Go Get Equin Drobble, Clan to Silio Go Go Go, the temperature got to 20. What the F was that, dude? Are you you want to hear, hear that again? Please. We need an instant replay. Can you slow it down? I can't, but here. Just up the road from Clan Byrd, Pushwing, Go Get Equin Drobble, Clan to Silio Go Go Go. The you, got to you want to hear it again? Yes, one more time. Where does it start? I'll tell you. Okay, ready? Are you ready? Where, where does the name start? That was the whole city's name. Is that like a secret handshake? You got to get it, you, or say that to get into the you, city? You're you, like, right, where are you from? I'll go and they, go they literally print that on the train side when Do you pull really? it. It's 58 characters long. It's the longest name in the world. Was it, was it, was it supposed to be a joke of some sort at one the, time? The alal is a clock. Let me, I'll try to read it for you here. It's Cla, Clanfer Willy Gwyn Gilagogory She We're in Dirab Willy and Tisilio Go Go Go. All right, I got the end. Do they shorten that? <laughs> and, and, that's, and that's when you can join in, and you'll be fine. As yeah. everyone's saying, you'll be like, go, go, go. That's, that's, <laughs> what I do, that's what I do in church as well. You know I'm what? like, yeah, all, hallelujah. Everyone likes to join at the end. Yeah, no one wants the four play. Now, 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 after. now, Caleb, how, how long is the – how many characters in the city? I think, would you say 58? 58. So I actually but, found but, – But hold on. But hold on. It's actually not 58. It's 58 characters plus in England. Well, I'm sorry, in America. Well, in United in States, America, yeah, it's, yeah. it's 58 characters. In England, it's actually 70. Because <laughs> it also ends with C-H-O-U-S-T-E-R-S-H-I-R-E. Clearly, another 12 characters, well, making it a grand sum total of 70. You know, we actually shortened it here in the United States, because you know how we do that. We're like WTF or whatever. Now it's called The Joint. <laughs> the Joint. <laughs> it's, it's a nice place. I actually like found it. a video on YouTube what on how to say it. depressing. So I'm going to play this quick video here. Well, it might not be quick. Let's see how it goes. But I haven't listened to it yet. But it's a how to say this word. Is there a carnival? <laughs> yeah, of course. There's a certain Welsh village which has become world famous simply because of its name. A name which enables the village to boast one of the longest railway station signs in the world. Situated on the beautiful Isle of Anderson. Is that Andrew is Hammond? <laughs> Is that you, Lord Jesus? This song will teach you how to say it. Okay, we don't need to hear the whole song. Ready? No, we, yeah, we do. Actually, we do need I'm liking it. That's nice. I'm, I'm thinking about covering it. I've, I've got a clan for you. This, got, this would make a fantastic punk song. song. You know what? This reminds me of like uh, the uh, school bell Oh, I was so rocks. enjoying that. I was about to masturbate. Okay, <laughs> that was like school bell rocks, right? You're like, I'm not a bill. I'm only a bill. This should have been the theme song to Fraggle Rock. It should have been. It might have been. 
I think this is I think this is the uh, theme song to your sex life, Stacey. I I'm gonna I'm gonna listen to this all night till I say this. While you touch yourself. Correct. Uh, and my very dry balls because I did put fresh balls on today. Well, good for you. All right, guys. Cut the music. Cut the music. We gotta go. <laughs> the show done. ran late. You're done. The Come show on, ran that was late. wonderful. I was it's enjoying a, it. This show is truly a disaster. I'm going to be singing it later on. I know. It, it was better than listening to Ben. <laughs> oh, <laughs> show was such a disaster. And his uh, jokes. Is, Jesus. Are you going to sue me over this? <laughs> I'm oh. Oh. Sue uh, Take it in deep. Going, going back. All right. Is you that kosher? Well, you know, I'm, I'm kind of sad we can't figure out what Sancho learned today. I'm not. Yeah, I mean, yeah. Yeah. you know I what I learned, learned today? What'd you learn today? Cheese? Uh, ben can't tell a joke, is uh. what I learned today. Oh, <laughs> really? And apparently he's Jewish. Go figure. Well, you yeah. already knew that because we were going to but, but did you know he played uh, semi pro hockey? Did he? What, for a FIFA team for somebody, maybe? <laughs> FIFA. He was with was FIFA. It, was it somebody in Canada? <laughs> it was. It was the gay hockey team. I also learned that uh, Joe never needs, uh, never needs a slump buster because he's no. always got a, uh, a fatty on uh, on hold. Look, I'm all, I'm always hitting in the fourth. He's spot. got one. That's or, what I'm saying, dude. He's got one or, or seven, maybe. And my, I, my and I learned that Cable's Apple uh, Mac is uh, shite. Yeah, yeah. I I also you know what I learned today. I learned that uh, the reason that Stacy doesn't like whales is because he doesn't like sticking it in a blowhole. <laughs> <laughs> now, I, I've learned something today. I learned that Wales is not named for the mammal, which was, you know, a huge thing. And I, I, I believe it's actually Kimuru, not Wales, by the way. But that's, uh, that's what oh, that's would the real? it. Oh, that's really? Right. Okay, well, man, I'm learning. C-Y-M-R-U. See, I learned something, and then I learned something back on top of that. Dude, this is a very educational show, guys. I think we're... we're it is. We it should is. probably get a well, government grant. Did someone uh, turn Ben's mic off? Because that's probably why. <laughs> <laughs> I think the number one thing we learned today is that Apple is shite. Shite? Good point. Do we all agree? Good. I, I think yeah. so. I think that's the only thing we I disagree. Agree. And that, and I that, disagree. Well, I think apple shite and orange uh, Belgian wheat is really good. That was good. Yeah. Was that what that drink was? It was definitely an orange bel- wheat ale. For Actually, sure. you're completely wrong. It was a lime wheat. It was, he so said it, it was had, a citrus it lime. It had like nine different oranges in it, yeah. buddy. Well, I'm going to play the outro. Well, I believe that goes citrus. You know what? Play, play the fucking outro. Seriously. Hold on. You haven't right. said the tagline. All, all Ukrainians question everything, consider anything. You should question while you listen to this goddamn show after listening to this one. We will be broadcasting live from <laughs> from the Lions Den next week. Maybe. How the fuck did this wind up being a train wreck show? All things considering. I don't know. I thought I did a really good when job. When I say all things, I think you know what I mean. All right, everyone, yeah. listen in well, next week. Well, see you later. All right, we'll talk to you soon. Hadra collision. X-ray from a vision. Internet transmissions of the cranial emissions. Say goodbye to Miguel Hito. In the midst of BC. Can we talk about sports and anything else that tickles our shorts? Oh, we won't refrain from talking to your name. Four to five doctors say it won't rot your brain. We gotta be going. And we hope that you will miss us. The bell has rung and, and the teacher has dismissed us. So don't be sad. Cause there's no need to freak. We'll, we'll be coming out your speaker same time next week. <laughs>